Hello. It's Lauren from Color the Kitty and Sipology. And in case you ever watched my other videos, yes, this is a Sipology mouse pad on the side. <laughs> Alright, I just want to do a quick talk about Sipology. Most importantly, ooh, I'm just peeking at the holiday stuffs, the 24 steeps. Because this is it for 2022, and I'm excited about it. Uh, this comes available October 1st through December 31st while supplies last. So ideally, if you want 24 steeps, get on it right away when it goes live. It's $32 this year. And as it says, it's got 24 tea blends. They claim each little tin is enough to make at least two cups of tea. I'd say more. It includes six exclusive holiday teas and much more and such. So this is it for the 2022. It's got a really neat box to it and look at all the teas. But what I want to show you is last year's and that's mine here. So last year it's who you share it with. Da, 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 da. Just seems got any more writing on it. It's got the Sipology website. And on the back side, let's see. Cute, cute. So, this is mine from last year. So, I'm just going to open it up and check it out. So, then here is the actual rest of the panel. In case you're curious what it looks like, which looks really cool. And then here's the tea. So, FYI, I only have one that's empty, and that was this really yummy tea. So underneath all of these tins will be what the tea is, and the instructions, and the information about them. So I'm going to do a quick breeze through on what we have here. I'm just going to move some of my lighting a tiny bit, because I know my lighting tends to make things a little more complicated. For when I'm doing art supplies. So we're just going to breeze through. So the first one here is cranberries and cream fudge. It's a black tea. This, this is last year's by the way. Then the green tea cinnamon sugar cookie. A pumpkin pie rubus tea. A mint chocolate chip rubus. A fruit tea juicy blackberry sangria. It actually sounds quite nice. This one I loved is an oolong tea was a lemon gelato. It was awesome. And in case you get these mixed up, there's numbers about 202107. So that was slot 7. That was Rubus maple cinnamon waffles. We have here puree tea cookie dough. Uh, Mrs. Claus cranberry pie. That sounds nice for Rubus tea. Guys, you can tell some of these I've used. I'm still working through them slowly because I have a really interesting random selector when it comes to tea. Number 10 is gingerbread puree. Number 11 was naturally sweet vanilla Earl Grey. This is the oolong. And then 12 was a green tea pomegranate martini. 13. I love this one. And I think it's back again this year. It's a latte. Winter spice chai latte. Oh, it was so good. This one was cranberry rose sangria. Fruit tea. Uh, black tea blood orange biscotti. This one's almost done. Uh, fruit tea, pumpkin banana bread, and then raspberry cream soda, fruit tea, and then we got black tea, sugar plum dream, then down here we have chocolate brownie black tea, uh, winter mint, green tea, oh this one was really good, I've had this one, I'm like oh my god it's so good, uh, black tea, cinnamon snickerdoodle, <laughs> nice names eh? And then fruit tea, strawberry lime daiquiri. Hmm, looks like I've had some. And then we've got naturally sweet candy cane black tea. And then the last one, which I have used quite a bit, is a holiday macchiato puree tea. Okay. So my favorite so far from last year was lemon gelato. That was awesome. Um, I love this winter spice chai latte. I love this winter mint. And there's a couple that really surprised me. Um, I'm trying to remember what they were. I don't know if it was pumpkin banana bread or pumpkin pie. One of these really surprised me. I forget which one now. 
and some were okay. Like, eh, it's all personal preference. But for me, why I like to get this every year now, and I am so getting this uh, again this year. Like, this is last year's uh, box, Jenny, and I was going to tag you at the end of the video just to kind of show what this looks like. And this one is fully empty. This is my favorite one. Like, for me, this is a great way to try different teas in a box set. And it's also fun to mix these, too. Because after a while, for some of these, I was kind of like, eh, I don't really like. For example, I'll be honest, I don't like this holiday macchiato. It's not my preference at all. I would take half a scoop of that and mix it with another one. So it's really fun. So there. I just wanted to show you what 24 Steeps looks like. Because we're coming up to the timeline when a new box is coming up available and as I shown in here here is the new one coming up October 1st so it's $72 plus shipping and taxes and yeah so if you're interested in 24 steeps or anything else in the Sipology collection hey let me know there's some great items that are in here I mean there's so so many items so yeah anyway that's all I just wanted to jump on and say, and hope you have a great night. Bye for now.